The administration don't see the importance. Uh, look at what happened. You went to Fisk. They were trying to sell the Georgia O'Keeffe paintings, which was the core. Two of the most important paintings in art history is at Fisk University in the Western art tradition. And they were trying to sell it so they could fix a roof or whatever, you know, to do some renovations on a building. And then pocket the difference, though, they could put it in some, who knows, some school booster program, I don't know. But the bottom line was the whole art world rose up, and even the Georgia O'Keeffe Foundation said, we will take them back and buy them back from you if you don't respect what we gave you. You know, it's amazing. You know, but unfortunately, you have, like I said, a lot of administrations and a lot of presidents at HCCU who talk the talk, but they don't walk the walk when it comes to evaluating, uh, putting value on their cultural artifacts. Does that mean that it just becomes another commodity they can sell to meet the bottom line? Do you need? Do they need better staff? Or I mean, like, what? Who is going to advocate within the school for the alumni? <laughs> That's what they need. They need the alumni. Aren't you an alumni? Uh, uh, yeah. Yes. Then you need to stay on there. If who does the school cater to? Let's be let's be real about where higher education is now in relation to art and culture. You know, it's become a corporation. Bottom line, they don't see the school as someplace where they're going to get transformed and learn. It's like. I'm paying you for a service. I deserve to get my aid. Give me my degree so I can go and get paid. All the extracurricular art and culture stuff that goes along with it, outside of the football game and the basketball game, where is What are we really value? Ephemeral entertainment or something that's really going to speak to us culturally a thousand years from now. Like when they write the story about black culture, when they're using the art to do so, most of that art is probably going to be preserved by white institutions. But most black institutions probably would have been so at all. That's so scary. So they can buy some football uniforms.